our other big story of the morning, making sure you and your family are safe on this Halloween. CBS 42's reporter Britt Moore is live this morning in Helena. Britt, I know there's some concern this morning about those creepy clown sightings. And you talk with police. How are they addressing that issue? Well, definitely more patrolling. Now, they're expecting thousands of trick-or-treaters in this neighborhood. This is Old Cahaba in Helena, uh, which is why police are making sure parents send out their kids with these glow sticks, glow necklaces, whatever it is, or reflective tape on their child's costumes, especially in neighborhoods like this one where there just aren't a lot of street lights. Now, church groups and parents often bus in their kids into this neighborhood every Halloween, and neighbors here tell me they welcome the increased crowd every year. Now, Shelby County Sheriff's deputies and Helena police will be out patrolling neighborhoods like this one all night, making sure everyone is staying safe. But when it comes to those recent clown threats, they're asking everyone to just be alert. There may be some older kids out there that are taking advantage of that, those rumors of, of the scary clowns. Um, please call us. We'll look into it. Now they're handling all and any clown sightings or anything else as they would any other suspicious call. No, coming up at 6:30, I talked to a man who says he's saying no to clowns altogether. He's taking a stand. I'll explain kind of what he's doing to uh, get rid of those clowns tonight on Halloween. For now, we're live in Helena, Britt Moore, CBS 42 News.